to a wonderful woman that's doing wonderful things in our community. Good morning to Miss Barbara Harvey. Good morning to you. Good morning, Cece. It is a pleasure to have you in the studios today because, you know, dear to my heart are our seniors, but and next to that are our children. And you are part of what organization that's supporting our children in our community? I'm, I'm the administrator for Albany Early College. And Albany Early College is a dual enrollment program um, within the Dorota County School System. And so today I just want to get the word out and let um, our community know that we are still in existence mm -hmm. and um, we're looking forward to serving your young scholars. Okay, when you talk about dual enrollment, early college, uh, what does that mean to our listeners? What, is that, what does that really mean? Dual enrollment allows um, high school students to begin earning college credits while they're still in high school mm -hmm. um, at no cost to the parents. Wow, at no cost to the parents. Okay, let's talk a little bit, because some people say, well, I remember early college on the campus of Albany State University. Correct. Talk, talk to me, is that really true now, or is this a new location? Correct. Um, we, in the past, since 2009, we were located on the campus of Albany State, mm -hmm. um, and this year, the beginning of this school year, we relocated to Albany High. Okay. Um, but we, you know, we have a separate wing, and but you know, we're we're doing great things still at Albany High, and so I still want parents and and the community to know that you know we are still working. Um, miracles in the, in the lives of children. Right, I know you were sharing some just statistics with me, but before we get into that, if, if, if there's a young person that's interested out there, or the parents are interested, what what's the qualification? Um, we're, we're still looking at a target population of 26th to um, 60th percentile, uh -huh. and so this is a group of students who the traditional setting just hasn't worked for them. Um, and we take them and we mold them, we work on um, certain skills uh -huh. that helps them to be prepared to end, um, start taking college classes in the 11th grade. Oh, okay, because I know you say the regular school environment because sometimes <clears throat> some of our children, I'm, I'm just listening to you talk and I, sometimes our children have those self-esteem issues, even though they may be extremely brilliant in the mind, Absolutely. but they, the, you know, they just have that little uh, situation, I call it. I don't call it a problem, a situation. And sometimes, excuse me, um, okay. sometimes uh, mainstream can be very intimidating. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, we, we kind of mother and father our kids and uh -huh. you know, we, we, we just nurture them yes. to make sure that they're getting the right skills and, and, and we're building their confidence to where they know what they're going to do and when they're going to do it and the timeline in which they need to do it in. Okay. Oh, well, thank you for that. Now, Barbara, if, if there are parents or, or students out there listening, how, what, how do they contact you in order to get involved or get enrolled? Okay. There are three ways to, um, to reach out and, and make contact with us. That's 431-1329, um, um, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. and that's area code 229, or they can contact 229-483-6300, um, extension 3721. There's also an email if parents would like for me to mail, um, send an application via mm -hmm. email, mm -hmm. and that's barbara.harvey at docoschools.org. Okay, and that again is? Barbara.harvey at docoschools.org. Okay. All right, now I, I know that this is one way that you're getting the word out about the program. What other avenues are there, you know, that maybe someone out there listening to they can, you know, uh, oh, I'll go check over here, other, you know, and anytime any parent would like to come and see what we're mm -hmm. doing, um, they're very much welcome to come, you know, to visit us at Albany High. Okay. Um, we're located on the east wing of mm -hmm. the second floor, mm -hmm. and they enter the building at the, at the front desk and just let the secretaries know that um, they're here to visit early college. Okay. Now, when you talk early college again, what is the earliest that a student can, can, can enroll? Um, in the past six years, we've had the um, middle high model. This year we have just the high school model, so um, a student entering ninth grade is welcome to apply, but we also have slots available for 10th and 11th graders. Okay, and what is the success rate? Because I know we talked earlier about statistics, and I, yes. I'm just so proud of that. We, we are very <laughs> proud. 
Um, last year was our first graduating class, and we call them, you know, their, their title is the Legacy. Mm -hmm. And we had 86% of the students, graduate, seniors graduate. We're very proud um, to say this year we have 100% of our seniors anticipated to graduate. Oh my God, that deserves a hand clap for me. I tell you, and I know what you're very sure. proud. Uh, a lot of our listeners out there. Okay, well, I do thank you, Ms. Barbara Harvey, for coming in. Is there anything else you want to share with our audience? You know, because you've got the floor. <laughs> um, I, again, I would just like to encourage parents to take advantage of this wonderful program that exists in the Board of County School System. Um, Dory County is, is making, um, you know, preparations and providing a wonderful, wonderful opportunity for our students. Okay, well, I thank you so much for gracing the studios of WZB and Phrase 105.5, and we welcome you back. Thank you. You know, even if you want to bring some of your students at some time, you know, we welcome you. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Okay, stay right here because we have more great music coming your way. And Miss T. Taylor from Paul Benny Rex and Fox.